This is what I hope Disney does with Amphibia in the future, so in the future. There is a spin-off of Amphibia where the first scene shows M's funeral and cuts to a few months later where three friends find a new and improved calamity box on the street. Opening it to try to return it to the owner? Accidentally transporting the three of them to Amphibia where 78 years have passed and Amphibia has changed but they appear in a different part of Amphibia. On the new continent set on the last episode of the series, and this time all three of them are together instead of Anne, Marcy, and Sasha. The three new friends walk to the closest civilization whilst eating bugs to survive and notices frogs, newts, toads, and more. So they get confused and after a while, one of them go up and asks them where they are, then all of the civilians bow down to the friends and they get even more confused and another friend asks why are they bowing down to them and one of the frogs says that their kind had saved them very long ago and the friends get hopeful and Asks the civilians how did their kind get home and the civilians say that they got home through a calamity box that looked like a chest but after they used it, the chest turned to dust and they were gone. The chest had charged stones and that's how they got home. And one of the friends pulled the chest out and asked if the stones looked like this. An Anut says yes but they were more colorful. One of the friends asked how they got the stones charged and a toad pops in and says that they had to go through trials to get the stones charged and only pure hearts could actually get the charged. One of the friends say that they heard a story of three girls saving the world from an alien invasion, but they thought that it was a myth. And then the show cuts to the credits, and then the episode ends, but there is a post credit scene of King Andreas' son, Sprig and Ivy's daughter and Grimes' son hanging out. It cuts to a picture of young Andreas, Leaf, and barrel burning signifying that the spin-off will have its own villain, but it won't be Andreas' son, Spring and Ivy's daughter, or Grimes' son. And the show will give us hints to who the villain is but won't show us until season 2 just like how Amphibia did. And that's the pilot of the show and that's all I'm going to talk about. So please hit the like button, subscribe button, and put notifications on. Helps out a lot and I will see you when I see you.